माय नेम इज तन्वी फ्रॉम जेड पी एच एस मांदापुर मंडल बी बी पेट डिस्ट्रिक्ट कामारेड्डी आई एम गोइंग टू से अबाउट बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ रिमोट सेंसिंग रिमोट सेंसिंग इज एन आर्ट एंड साइंस ऑफ ऑप्टेनिंग इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट एन ऑब्जेक्ट आ फीचर विदाउट फिजिकली कमिंग इन कॉन्टैक्ट विद दट ऑब्जेक्ट आ फीचर ह्यूमेंस अप्लाई रिमोट सेंसिंग इन द डे टू डे बिजनेसेज थ्रू विजन हियरिंग एंड सेंस ऑफ स्मेल द डाटा कलेक्टेड कैन बी ऑफ मेनी फॉर्म्स वेरिएशन इन एकॉस्टिक वेव डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एग्जाम्पल सोनार वेरिएशन इन फोर्स डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एग्जाम्पल ग्राविटी मीटर वेरिएशन इन इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक एनर्जी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एग्जाम्पल आई एक्सेट्रा दीज रिमोटली कलेक्टेड डाटा थ्रू वेरियस सेंसर्स मे बी एनलाइज टू ऑप्टेन इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट द ऑब्जेक्ट आ फीचर एंड आ इन्वेस्टिगेशन इन दिस कोर्स वी विल डील विथ रिमोट सेंसिंग थ्रू इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक एनर्जी सेंसर्स ओनली दस रिमोट सेंसिंग इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ इन्फरिंग सर्फेस पैरामीटर्स फ्रॉम मेजरमेंट ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक रेडिएशन फ्रॉम द अर्थ सर्फेस दिस ई एम आर कैन आई द बी रिफ्लेक्टेड और एमिटेड फ्रॉम द अर्थ सर्फेस इन अदर वर्ड रिमोट सेंसिंग इज डिटेक्टिंग एंड मेजरिंग इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक रेडिएशन रिफ्लेक्टेड और एमिटेड डिस्टेंट ऑब्जेक्ट मेड ऑफ वेरियस मटीरियल्स सो दैट वी कैन आइडेंटिफाई एंड कैटेगराइज दिस ऑब्जेक्ट बाई क्लास और सब्सटेंस फीचर इज डन थ्रू द यूनिकनेस ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट और सर्फेस फीचर रिमोट सेंसिंग प्रोवाइड्स ए मीन ऑफ ऑब्जर्विंग लॉज एरिया इट फाइन अ स्पेशल एंड टेम्परल फ्रीकुंट it finds existential applications in civil engineering includes watershed studies hydrological states flexual simulations hydrological monitoring disaster management services such as flood and drought warning and monitoring damages assessment in case of natural calamities environmental monitoring and disaster management electromagnetic energy electromagnetic energy or electromagnetic radiation that is emr energy is propagated in the forms of an advancing in reactions between electric and magnetic fields in the it travels with the velocity of light visible light ultraviolet rays infrared rays heat radio waves x rays or all the different forms of electromagnetic energy electromagnetic energy that is e can be either be expressed in terms of frequency that is e of wavelength or lambda that is radiance has e equals to hcf or hc by lambda various h is prime constant continuous 6.626 into 10 to the power of minus 34 geoseconds c is cal c is celerity or speed of light 3 into 10 to the power of 8 meter per seconds f is frequency expressed in hertz ye h is lambda expressed in micrometers 1 mu equals to 10 to the power of minus meters minus 6 meters can be expressed can be has can be observed from these equations shorter wavelength have higher energy content longer wavelength have lower energy content distribution of the spectrum in remote sensing terminology electromagnetic energy is generally expressed in terms of wavelength that is lambda or matrix reflect emit or radiate a range of electromagnetic energy depending upon the material characteristics in remote sensing it is a measurement of electromagnetic radiation reflected or emitted reflected or emitted from an object principles of remote sensing Dip- different object reflect or emit different amount of energy in different bands of electromagnetic spectrum the amount of energy reflected or emitted depends upon the properties of both the materials and the incident energy angle of incidence intensity and wavelength detection and discrimination of object or surface feature is done through the uniqueness of reflected or emitted electromagnetic radiation from the object a device to detect this reflected or emitted electromagnetic radiation from an object is called a sensor example cameras and scanners a vehicle used to carry the sensors is called a platform example aircrafts and satellites main stages in remote sensing are the following a emission of electromagnetic radiation example the sun or an emr source located on platform b transmission of energy from the source to the object c interaction of emr with the object and subsequent reflection and emission d transmission of energy with the object by the sensor e recorded energy by the sensor example tra- photographic or non photographic sensor f recorded information to the ground station g processing of the data into digital or hard copy image h analysis of data 
passive and active remote sensing different object depends upon the source of electromagnetic energy remote sensing can be classified as passive remote sensing and active remote sensing in the case of passive remote sensing source of energy is that naturally available such as the sun most of the remote sensing platforms work in passive mode using solar energy as a source of emr solar energy reflected by the target at specific wavelength bands are recorded using sensors on board airborne or spaceborne platforms in order to ensure ample signal strength received at the sensors wavelength or energy band capable to traversing through atmosphere without significant loss through atmospheric interactions any object which is at a temperature above 0 degrees kelvin emits some radiation which is approximately proportional to fourth power of the temperature of the object does the earth also emit some radiation since its absent temperature is 300 degrees kelvin emit some radiation passive sensors is similar to passive sensors can also be used to measure the earth's radiance in case of active remote sensing the energy is generated and sent from the remote sensing platforms towards the targets or the towards the targets the energy recorded using sensors on board remote sensing platforms reflected back from the targets as a simple analogy as passive sensors is similar to taking a picture with an ordinary camera various active sensors is analogy as for taking a picture with camera have built in flash schematic representation of passive and active remote sensing remote sensing platforms in the case of passive remote sensing remote sensing platforms remote sensing platforms provide a mean of observing basic based on the elevation at which these platforms are placed ground level remote sensing ground level remote sensors are very close to the ground they are basically used to calibrate sensors and develop the earth surface aerial remote sensing low latitude aerial remote sensing high latitude aerial remote sensing space borne remote sensing space shuttles polar orbiting satellites geostationary satellites airborne and space borne remote sensing in the case of airborne remote sensing sensors mounted on aircrafts are used to obtain images of the earth surface very high spatial resolution images 20 cm or less can be obtained through this however it is not suitable to map a large area less coverage area high cost per unit area of ground coverage or the major disadvantages of airborne remote sensing while airborne remote sensing missions offer only one time operations in space borne missions continuous monitoring of the earth feature and logious aerial photography videography thermal imaginary digital photography are commonly used in remote sensing platforms in space borne remote sensing sensors mounted on space shuttles orbiting satellites or the from the earth they are basically used in example geostationary and polar orbiting satellites there are several remote sensing satellites example geostationary and polar orbiting satellites while geostationary or polar orbiting satellites exist in are used for communication and meteorological purposes polar orbiting and sun synchronization satellites are essentially used for remote sensing platforms the major advantages of space borne remote sensing are large area coverage less cost per unit area of coverage continuous and frequent coverage or the automatic or semi automatic computerized processing and analysis of data various aerial remote sensing is however when compared to aerial photography satellite imaginary is royal resolution advantages and disadvantages of remote sensing advantages of remote sensing are advantages of remote sensing provides data for large area provides data for large area provides data for very remote and inaccessible regions able to obtain imaginary for an area over a certain period of time through which any anthropogenic or natural changes in landscapes can be analyzed relatively inexpensive when compared to employing team of survive easy and rapid collection of data rapid products in map for interpretation disadvantages of remote sensing the interpretation imaginary requires a certain skill level need cross verification with ground fields survive data data from multiple source may create confuse 
डाट ऑफ अ मल्टीपुल सोर्स मे क्रिएट कन्फ्यूज ऑब्जेक्ट कैन मिस क्लासीफाइड और कन्फ्यूज मे अकर्स इन इमेजनरी ड्यू टू द रिलेटिवली मोशन एंड सेंसर्स एंड सोर्स थैंक यू